If students don't see the need for a certain resource, chances are they would ignore it. Given their busy schedules, they would need to filter out what they really need to achieve a goal. A good way of doing this is designing your activity or exercise first within the lesson. These are the online opportunities for them to practice what they need to achieve the learning outcomes. Then provide them with links to resources that will help them answer or complete the activity. Just like in this lesson slide, notice that there is a clear link up here to open up a resource for guidance on this exercise. You can also arrange your content and present resources before the exercise as in this example. Or make a jump to a resource slide if they give an incorrect answer to their exercise. In the Edit tab, select to add a question. This is what you'll use to add different kinds of questions in a lesson as you would in a quiz. Select your question type, give it a meaningful title. You can also include contents or links to resources on this page type before you give the answer choices. Decide on the score, feedback, and page jump for certain choices. If you need more space for answer choices, save your question page first, then go to the lesson settings and change the option for the maximum number of answers here. This option can be changed at any time because it's only visible to the instructors.